Hi. This video is so full of crazies and nonsense. It's got a lot of bloopers. I was having a real tough time. So I hope you all enjoy. And I will see you all again tomorrow. Bye. Maybe a necklace would be pretty. <laughs> I'll put it out. All right. Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. How was your day today? The day after Thanksgiving. A lot of you probably had big meals yesterday and you're feeling that you're not as hungry. Well, that's me today. I'm not as hungry. In fact, Jim was gonna have some dressing and he asked if I wanted any and I really didn't feel like it. And so I didn't have any, but it sure smelled good. It was the keto dressing that he had, the one with the broccoli and cauliflower and mushrooms and the different meats in it. Well, today um, I had some some turkey bits, bites or whatever they're called, and they're they're okay. I put them in the in the dehydrator. They were from I think they were from Aldi's. I'm not even sure where we got them from, but. Um, Jim knew that I was I wanted to do some more um, of the salami so he went down and he bought me three bags of salami I want to show you what the salami this is I'll show you the salami bag this is the salami that we are drying putting in the dehydrator and drying okay now this is what it looks like whoops let me I'll hold it up it might be easier this is what it looks like when it comes out of the package. This is what it looks like after I've after I've dried it. This that comes out of the package, you're supposed to be able to just eat. But you know what? After you've put it in the dehydrator, it tastes so much better. So that's what I did today. I um, dehydrated some salami. You want to put these back in the package? And leave the two that I already dried. I'll eat them. Not at this moment, but I will eat them. Um, today's kind of, uh, I've got nothing to say. It was very quiet. It got dark early. I fed the chickens. I gave them the leftover bones from the, from the turkey yesterday. I boiled it to make my broth. And then I put them out, put them in a container and saved it so I could give it to them today. And they cleaned those bones lickety split and cleaned everything up really fast. So those of you that don't know, chickens do eat meat. There's people that were, were a little surprised where my husband works. They do eat bugs too, so that's their protein. So they will eat meat. They like meat. <laughs> Take two. Yep. Not 11, but two. <laughs> um, hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> how do you do? My name is Mary Grayson. How are you? No, it's not that. <laughs> oh, no. That's not it. Let's see. Start again. Over. I'll find that one. Hi, everyone. It's Nona Grace. And I'm from Western New York. I'm having a really hard time with this video. Nothing exciting happened today. Today's the day after Thanksgiving. I've watched a few movies. I've dehydrated some more salami. And I will show you what the salami looks like. Oh, I had you put them away. <laughs> I guess I have to get them out again. I'm sorry. I need a couple pieces. Just a couple. If you hear any rattling of a bag, it's because Jim's helping me. He's getting me the salami that I had him put away. Oh, gosh. Thank you. Okay. This is what it looks like before you dry it. This is what it looks like after you dry it. It is so good. One is enough. That's good. I did one and one. Here you go. You can put that away or you can eat it. I don't care what you do with it. Um, but... It's so much tastier after you've dried it. So if you want to do some dehydrating and you want it to be easy and simple and tasty, just get yourself some salami 
and it's little rounds of salami and they're cut perfectly and I put them in the, the dehydrator and I do it for about six hours on the meat temperature that your dehydrator says. That is it for today. Um, nothing exciting happening. I hope you had a great day. I hope you rested after yesterday's big to-do. And um, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. This one's just about as bad as the other one. But it'll still stay, I guess.